Welcome back, everybody. We are going to do a unit on the weather systems and singing some fun songs. But before we get going, you should have just done your welcome song. And now we're going to do our brain break. So go ahead and stand up. Liquid. Oh, my God. Uh -oh. Let's start at the beginning. Here we go. Technology is being silly. Give me just a minute. Let's try that again. Liquid. Water, 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 cycle. Get, get out your seat. I'm getting kind of thirsty in here. Water, 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 cycle. Take it. Round and round and round goes the water cycle. Water, 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 cycle. Come on, y'all get down with the water cycle. Let's do it. Here we go. Precipitation, water falls down. Accumulation, water gathers all around. Evaporation, water rising from the ground. Transpiration, when you sweat the water out. Condensation, water turns into a cloud. When the cloud gets heavy, the water cycle just keeps going round. Precipitation, water falls down. Accumulation, water gathers all around. Evaporation, water rising from the ground. Transpiration, when you sweat the water out. Condensation, water turns into a cloud. When the cloud gets heavy, what Happens. It just keeps going round. Oh, that's really dope, actually. Water, 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 water cycle. Oh. Round and round and round goes the water cycle. Yeah. Water, 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 water cycle. Water. Come on, y'all get down with the water cycle. Precipitation. We're talking rain, sleet, hail, snow. Oh, Ooh. accumulation. Into rivers, oceans, and the ground, you know. You know it. Evaporation. That steam rising from the spout. I'd love a spot of tea. Transpiration. Flowers and leaves and stems sweat the water out. Condensation. Drops appear on the side of your glass when water turns to a liquid from a gas. Meow. Water, 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 water cycle. Yeah. Round and round and round goes the water cycle. Water, 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 water cycle. Come on, y'all get down with the water cycle. One more time. Precipitation. Water falls down. Accumulation. Water gathers all around. Evaporation. Water rising from the ground. Transpiration. Plants put the water out. Sweat condensation. Water turns into a cloud. And when the cloud gets heavy, what happens? You know, it just keeps going around and 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 around. Okay, we get it. Water, 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 water cycle. Water. Round and round and round goes the water cycle. Water, 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 water cycle. Yeah. Come on, y'all get down with the water cycle. Woo. Yeah. What's up, Mr. Catman? I'm a little teapot, short and stout. Here is my handle. Here is my spout. Meow. Hey, you let him in, didn't you? Oh, yeah, yeah, I let him in. See? That was me. Give, give him a bowl of milk and, and make sure it don't evaporate. I think I need a sip of water. Get it from the cycle. Okay. Do any of you nerds have an umbrella? This precipitation is dampening my fur. Meow. Watch another video. All right, great job. Go ahead and have a seat. I want you to get your heart rate under control. We want a slow, steady beat. So if you have a fast, steady beat or just a bunch of blah, 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 blah we got to fix that. So put your hand over your heart. If you can feel your heart beating, that means we need to slow it down. If you can't, that's okay. But I want us to breathe in through our nose, out through our mouth. Breathe in through our nose, out through our mouth. We want to calm our heart right down and get a slow heartbeat. So breathe in through your nose and breathe out through your mouth. Very good. <clears throat> All right, so. Uh, this is our composer of the week. Her name is Florence Price. So another lady composer. She was born April 9th in 1887 in Little Rock, Arkansas and died June 3rd, 1953. If we have time, we'll take a little virtual field trip to Arkansas, but if not, that's okay because it is in America. One of the first noted African American women classical symphonic composers. So that is pretty awesome. She's also a pianist. Remember, a pianist is someone who plays the piano. An organist, so an, if a pianist plays the piano, an organist would play the organ. And she was a music teacher. She had two siblings. 
and her dad was a dentist and her mom was a music teacher. So I'm betting that's where she got her musical ability from. So her first performance was at the age of four and it was published. That means anybody could go buy her, her um, composition at the age of 11. That's pretty cool. So she performed at four and then published a composition at the age of 11. That's pretty cool. So she became a composer at the age of 11. She went to college and majored in piano and organ and she studied composition. If you're going to be a composer, right, because composers make music for musicians, you have to study composition when you go to college, how to do that. And she wrote her first string trio, trio meaning three, so three strings, and symphony. And guys, she's from our area. She moved to Atlanta at the age of 23 and became the head of Clark Atlanta University. So you might know where that is. Maybe your family's been there or attended there. Or you have siblings there. But I thought it was pretty cool that she is from our area. All right, so we're going to listen to a little bit of one of her pieces, and it's a violin concerto. All right, and I know you're going to say, Ms. Kaiser, why did you stop that? But it's a 14-minute piece, almost 15 minutes. So if you really like this, maybe you can get your parents to go on YouTube for you on a non-school device and just look up viral, Violin Number 2 by Florence Price. But I think it's beautiful. I loved hearing it. It sounds so romantic to me. And you've got some instruments that we've talked about before. We've studied with Hispanic Heritage. There's the double bass. And you've got some cellos and a harp. And she was playing the violin. And you see some other violins and violas. And then you've got the conductor who, who uses his hands to tell the band what to do. All right, so what are you doing today? Today I can recall information about our composer of the week, Florence Price. I can explain the weather and weather systems. I can explain, well, I typed that completely wrong, but I can explain what a meteorologist does. I can explain hot and cold through the song we learned today. I can explain the sun, wind, clouds, rain, and snow through the songs and dances we learned today. I can keep a steady beat and follow the movements to the dances we learned today. And I can make connections from the book we read to the weather systems we learn about, which hopefully we have time to get to. All right, so I'm going to, first of all, I'm going to fix the volume because I'm afraid it's too soft and I don't want it to be too soft for you. All right, so we're going to watch a short little song about weather systems.
Weather is a combination of many things. It never stays the same. It's always changing. Precipitation will come in many forms, depending if the temperature is cold or warm. If it's cold, you see, it could be windy. Blowing snow and sleet could make the roads icy. If it's warm, you know, you could see a tornado. Watch the rain pouring down and see a thunderstorm show. Hey, the weather is the state of the atmosphere. Hot, cold, wet, dry, look into the sky. Hey, the weather is the state of the atmosphere. Stormy, cloudy, calm, clear. Weather happens all year. You can use a thermometer. Hurricanes form in the warm ocean water. The most powerful storm when compared to any other. Tornadoes are smaller, but the damage can be greater. A watch means it's possible. A warning, take cover. Hey, the weather is the state of the atmosphere. Hot, cold, wet, dry. Look into the sky. Hey, the weather is the state of the atmosphere. Stormy, cloudy, calm, clear. Weather happens all year. job and if you did some of the dance moves awesome go ahead and have a seat if you danced along to it so hey that song said weather is the state of the atmosphere hot cold wet dry sunny cloudy rainy snowy foggy windy right so we're going to learn about all of that today and the first thing is what is a meteorologist do you know what a meteorologist does well, in this picture here, you've probably seen somebody like this with this little thing in the background. And a meteorologist studies the weather and they tell you what the weather is going to do. So maybe that's something you're interested in. Maybe you really like studying weather and you like learning about storms and hurricanes and snow. So maybe you might want to be a meteorologist. But meteorologists help us study the weather and tell us what the weather is going to do. We also use a thermometer. Raise your hand if you've ever seen a thermometer. Good job, put your hands down. So if you haven't, that's totally okay, but the thermometer tells us what the temperature is. And you see there's an F and a C, that's Fahrenheit and Celsius, okay? In America, we use Fahrenheit, so we use this side, okay? So we use a thermometer to tell us what the temperature is. All right, so temperature. Temperature means something is hot or cold. Think in your head for a minute. Can you name some things that are hot? Good, how about like a fire is hot, right? Or a stove could be hot. Okay, now in your mind, name some things that are cold. 
Good job. How about ice cubes are cold, right? Snow is cold. So we're going to listen and sing along to a song about cold and warm. It's sunny in the summer, warm, warm, warm. I'm playing in the sun with the cows on the farm. It's warm, the sun is shining, shining on our skins. We're happy when summer begins. Moo, 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 moo. It's snowing in the winter, cold, cold, cold. <clears throat> Two big and round snowballs, yes, that is what I've rolled. Wow. It's cold, the snow is falling, come outside if you can. Let's make from snowballs a snowman. We sing about the weather. I like this and I like that. It's time to sing together. La 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 la. It's sunny in the summer. Warm, warm, warm. I'm playing in the sun with the cows on the farm. It's warm, the sun is shining, shining on our skins. We're happy when summer begins. Moo, moo, moo. Snowballs, yes, that is what I've rolled. Wow, it's cold, the snow is falling. Come outside if you can. Let's make from snowballs a snowman. La 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 la. Warm, cold, warm, cold. We sing about the weather. I like this and I like that. It's time to sing together. All right, so we learned about warm, or you could say hot and cold and that there are seasons that those go with, winter and summer, and we're going to learn more about the four seasons later, but now we know the difference between hot and cold. Yeah. And now we're going to talk about the sun. So is the sun hot or cold? Good job. Yeah, the sun is hot. So we're going to sing a song about the sun, Mr. Sun. <laughs> Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on me. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, hiding behind a tree. These little children are asking you to please come out so we can play with you. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, Please shine down on me. Yeah. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on me. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, hiding behind a tree. Oh, these little children are asking you to please come out so we can play with you. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on, please shine down on, please shine down on me. All right, so that's a great song about the sun and how it's shiny and we like to be outside because it makes everything nice and warm unless we live in Georgia like we do and it makes everything very hot. But <laughs> we do enjoy the sun. All right, so we're gonna take a brain break. So go ahead and stand up. Make sure you have lots of room.
All right, great job. Go ahead and have a seat. Breathe in through your nose. Breathe out through your mouth. We want a slow, steady heartbeat. Breathe in through your nose. Breathe out through your mouth. All right, so we're going to sing a song, You Are My Sunshine, and I recorded it, and I tried to make it as loud as I could, so hopefully you can hear me. All right, guys, we're going to sing a song called You Are My Sunshine, and first I'm going to teach it to you. It goes like this. You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. Can you sing that with me? You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. All right, now when we sing it, I want you to make your hands like this, like you're the sun. So you're going to go, you are my sunshine, my only sunshine. All right, then you're going to smile and say, you make me happy when skies are gray. Can you do that with me? You make me happy when skies are gray. All right, now let's put that together. Ready? You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are gray. You never know, dear, how much I love you. Can you do that part with me? You never know, dear, how much I love you. And I just made a little heart with my hands. Okay? And there you say, please don't take my sunshine away. Can you do that last part with me? Please don't take my sunshine away. Can we do the whole song together? All right. You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are gray. You never know, dear. How much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. All right, now I'm going to use an ukulele. It's like a little baby guitar. It's Hawaiian and it sounds a little bit different. But I'm going to play. I'm already out of tune. That's the ukulele for you. I'm going to play along and we're going to sing, okay? I'll get you coming in in just a minute. singing along to that so we know all about the sun but then sometimes clouds happen right and do clouds make it hotter or cooler yeah they make it cooler because they block out the sun okay so we're gonna do some sesame street ellie goulding uh, who's a pretty famous singer about clouds <laughs> Up in the sky, drifting with the wind, soaring on by, clouds of the raindrops, red fall, bringing water, clean, clean water down to us all. And that is why, when I see it, all I say, thank you, clouds. Nature to love. Say thank you, clouds. Thank 
All right. So the clouds also bring rain. Do they always bring rain, though? No, not always. Just sometimes they bring rain. So that's clouds. But we're going to talk about rain because the rain, where does that come from? We just said clouds. So we're going to do, go ahead and stand up. We're going to do a singing in the rain brain break. Healthy music for a child's heart, body, and mind. Singing in the Rain, from the award-winning CD, Rock and Roll Songs That Teach, by the Learning Station. What's wrong? We're bored. It's raining outside, and we have nothing to do. I've got an idea. Okay. Singing in the rain, we're singing. position. up with a book called The Rain Came Down. Hello, reading friends. It's Annie. You look down, down on a very, very rainy day. Join, Join with me as we read The Rain, rain Came, came down. down. If you have a copy, go get it so you can read along with me. The Rain, rain Came, came down. down by David, David Shannon. On, On Saturday, Saturday morning, the rain, rain came down. It, it made, made the chickens squawk. The cat, the cat yelled, yelled at the chickens and the, and the dog, dog barked at the cat. cat. And, and still, the rain came, came down. down. The, man the man yelled at the dog, dog and woke up the baby. Stop all that yelling, shouted the man's wife. The dog barked louder, and still the rain came down. A policeman heard the noise and stopped to see what was wrong. His car was blocking traffic, and half a block away, a woman squirmed in the back of a taxi. Hurry up, or I'll miss my plane! She told the taxi driver, so he started honking his horn. 
The truck driver in front of him got mad and started honking back. I have tomatoes to deliver, he shouted. The ice cream man heard the honking and turned up the music on his van. Jingle a jingle, went his music. Slap a de slap, went his windshield wipers. And still, the rain came down. The owner of the beauty parlor came out to see what all the fuss was about. She bumped into the barber coming out of his barber shop, and they began to argue. Up on his ladder, the painter grumbled, I can't paint in the rain. He started to climb down and bonk the barber in the head with his can of paint. Now all three of them were arguing. Next, the baker stepped out of his bakery. My roof is leaking and my cakes are getting wet, he moaned. He opened his umbrella and poked the pizza man in the nose. So they joined in the bickering, too. A boy ran by, chasing a small boat down the stream in the gutter. He splashed a little girl, and she began to cry. And still, the rain came down. The grocery man stomped out onto the sidewalk and yelled, Where is that delivery truck? I need my tomatoes! He ran into a lady coming out of the clothing store and knocked her boxes into his fruit stand. Oranges, apples, and lemons bounced down the sidewalk. And still, the rain came down. The policeman walked back to his car. What is all this ruckus about? he asked. The whole block was honking, yelling, bickering, and barking. And then, the rain stopped, and so did the noise. The sun came out, and the air smelled fresh and sweet. Everything shimmered, and a rainbow stretched across the rooftops. It's much too nice a day to be arguing, said the baker. I have cakes to bake, and I have a pizzas to make said the pizza man. I could use a shave while my building dries, said the painter to the barber. Then they went inside. The policeman said, Everything looks A-OK here to me. And he drove off in his car. The woman in the taxi decided she had time to have her hair done before her trip, and she went into the beauty parlor. So the lady with the boxes got into the taxi and went home. The truck driver told the grocer, I have your tomatoes. Wonderful, said the grocer. But first I have to pick up this fruit. The little girl and boy helped him, so he bought them ice cream cones. And the ice cream man gave them each an extra scoop because it was such a nice day. Then the man, his wife, and their baby had a picnic together in the backyard, while the dog, the cat, and the chickens slept in the, in the warm, warm afternoon sun. sun. Did you notice what happened to all the people in the story when the sun came out? The sun can brighten not only the sky, it can brighten our mood, too. I hope you enjoyed our story today. All right, I definitely enjoyed our story today. So, fix this real quick because there's one thing we didn't get to, but I'm going to do it next week. So, you're learning targets. You now should be able to say, I can recall information about our composer of the week, Florence Price. I can explain the weather and weather systems. We learned about that today, right? It's the state of the atmosphere windy, snowy, sunny, cloudy. I can explain what a meteorologist does. They're the ones who study the weather and tell us what the weather is going to do. I can explain hot and cold through the song we learned today. I can explain the sun, wind, clouds, rain, and we didn't get to snow, but I will make sure we get to it next week. I can keep a steady beat and follow the movements to our dances we learned today, and I can make connections to the, from the book we read to the weather systems we learned about. So again, your assignment is to just answer the exit ticket at the end of the learning path, and you are good to go. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me. I hope you have a great week.